This is your first hands-on video of the new 2019 Mac Pro and the Apple Pro Display XDR. Welcome everyone, it is Andrew here from Apple Insider, and we have both the new Apple Pro Display XDR and the new Mac Pro. Starting off with the Apple Pro Display XDR, which stands for Extreme Dynamic Range and not just High Dynamic Range. This new display is a monster. It is a 32 inch Retina 6K display with up to 1600 nits of brightness with a sustained brightness of 1000 nits. Comparatively, the new MacBook Pros only have a 500 nit brightness. There's also a 1 million to 1 contrast ratio and an extremely super wide viewing angle. There are all the other specs that you come to expect from an Apple Pro monitor, including 10-bit color depth, support for the P3 wide color gamut, and even a vase mount so you can mount this to the wall. Aside from several different reference modes, it is also expertly calibrated and supports Apple's True Tone technology. The whole display is metal and has that same lattice work pattern along the back that we saw on the Mac Pro body. Not only is it interesting visually, but it serves a big purpose of being a heatsink for that ridiculous brightness that it puts out. The stand is also very cool, there's a lot of tech that went into the stand that makes it feel almost like it's weightless to move the display up and down as well as rotate it. It also comes completely detached from the stand, which makes it easy to take out to a worksite or use it in the studio. The stand does come separate and it'll set you back an additional $999. There are two different versions of the display, one with a normal anti-reflective coating on it, and the second with a special matte finish that uses nano etches in the glass to disperse the light and reduce reflection even further, though that ultimate anti-reflective screen is going to cost you an additional grand over top of the base model. Everything here is powered by Thunderbolt 3, and there's four of those ports along the back for expanded I.O., and that 6K resolution will give you a PPI of 218, which meets Apple's requirements for Retina display. This will pair expertly with any Apple machine that has Thunderbolt 3, but it'll go particularly well for the 2019 Mac Pro. This new monster of a machine was re-engineered from the ground up with a stainless steel space frame and an aluminum housing that fits over top. There are optional wheels that can go on the bottom to move around, a new Mac routing option that'll work great for large farms of these things, and easy to move handles along the top. Expandability and modularity are key with the new Mac Pro. Along the back you'll see the 8 PCI slots that you can attach a variety of different new internal components. There are two 10 gigabit ethernet ports along the bottom. On the back there are two USB-A ports and two Thunderbolt 3 ports as well as an audio jack. And on top there are two easy to access Thunderbolt 3 ports as well. The 2019 Mac Pro can handle up to 28 cores internally which requires up to 300 watts of power. All that is cooled by a massive heatsink so this processor can get every little ounce of power out of it and not being restricted by thermal limitations. Inside there are 12 physical DIMM slots which means it can handle up to 1.5 terabytes of memory. Looking inside once more of those 8 PCIe slots, there are 4 double wide slots, 3 single wide slots, and 1 half length slot that Apple pre-fills with the I.O. that we talked about before, 2 USB-A, 2 Thunderbolt 3, and a headphone jack. It can also be configured with two Radeon Pro Vega 2 Duos, which will deliver an unparalleled amount of graphical performance. Apple is also introducing Apple Afterburner, which allows you to work through 8K and 4K videos natively from the start without any proxy media necessary. The new Mac Pro and the new Apple Pro Display XDR are remarkably powerful pieces of hardware and will debut this fall. Mac Pro pricing starts at $59.99 and the Apple Pro Display XDR starts at $49.99. Let us know what you think down below in the comments. Hey everyone, did you guys like that video? Be sure to click on that like button so we can create content that we know that you guys want to see. And follow Apple Insider on all social media channels. If you want the best prices on any Apple gear, check out the Apple Insider price guide that is updated daily. And until next time, we'll see you later.